Kia ora you're here with me, the Multi Wargamer, and today we'll be playing a Warhammer 40k Battle Report 2. Alright, so we're So today will be a 50 power level battle between the Chaos Space Marines, the Crimson Slaughter, and the Space Wolves, uh, playing on this Imperial planet. If you watched the previous series, uh, the Moonbase Classius, this is a prelude to the events uh, that took place there. So Imperial planets being overrun by Chaos called for Imperial aid and the Space Wolves answered the call. So the patrol mission uh, were both set up in our deployment zones. Uh, the remain remainders of our armies will be rolling for reserves to come on. Uh, we've got the attack bike, the Grey Hunters and the Predator set up on this side of the field. And my Hellbrute, Cultists and Sorcerer on this side. Um, now we're just going to go see, roll off to see who deploys. Uh, victory is, you get a victory point for each unit that is uh, destroyed. But let's take a look at the armies we'll be playing today. Leading the Chaos Space Marines, we have a Sorcerer and Terminator armor equipped with a four staff and a combi bolter. A 10 man Chaos Space Marine squad with a plasma gun, a heavy bolter, and an Icon of Wrath, a 30-man squad of Chaos Cultists with 17 auto guns, one heavy stubber, one flamer, a champion with a shotgun and a sword, and 13 with auto pistols. Five possessed with uh, horrifying mutations. Five raptors with three chainsaw bolt pistols, a mounted gun, and a leader with twin lightning claws and a hell brute with a multi mounter power fist and storm bolter leading the space walls we have a wolf lord with a storm bolter and a frost sword and a wolf librarian with a four staff and a flying baby 10 man gray hunter squad with uh, bolt pistols chain swords power sword plasma pistol power fist just a mix of everything there, eh? Just to make it annoying to commentate on what they really have. Five-man Wolfguard Terminator squad with a Thunder Hammer, Chain Fist, Lightning Claw, Storm Bolter, Heavy Flamer, Assault Cannon. Again, just a Frankenstein mix of weapons. A Swift Claw Attack Bike with a multi mounter and Twin Bolt Gun. And a Predator with a Twin Laz Cannon and a Storm Bolter. So I won the uh, roll-off and Looks like we'll have Crimson Slaughter, Chaos Space Marines uh, for turn one. So here we go with the movement phase. Uh, the cultists are moving six inches. You know when you when you join me here on the Moldy Wargamer. You're looking for nothing but quality entertainment. And do I ever disappoint you? No, the viewers, you love this. 30 tedious movements. Done. Move this guy. Five inches. Done. Move that guy. Done. What a thrilling and engaging movement phase. So, my... Sorcerer is going to cast Warp Time on the Cultists. That goes off on a 6. And we've got an 11. So the Cultists get another move, which I'll save you the pain of having to watch uh, us move again. And then next we're going to cast Prescience, which grants plus 1 to hit rolls. Um, and we're going to cast that again on the Cultists. That is going off on a 7. Oh, 5. Alright, so the Hellbrute just advanced. These 30 cultists are going to prepare to shoot into the Predator. The Sorcerer has advanced as well. So, we'll come back with the shooting phase for the Crimson Slaughter. Alright, so we've got 17 auto gun shots into the tank. Hitting on 4s. Come back to you. 
So 11 hits and strength 3, toughness 7, so wounding on 6s. 1. One wound. Ooh, let's see. Alright, so end of Crimson Slaughter turn 1. Uh, just move forward, nothing really happening at the moment. Too early to call. As we move now into Space Wolves turn 1. Alright, so end of Space Wolves movement phase. The tank has moved forward. Grey Hunters don't look like they've moved at all. I don't really remember. <laughs> and uh, the bike has driven through a barricaded wall somehow. I don't know if it's got some sort of ghost form. But uh, yeah, amazing. Let's go into their shooting phase. So. Uh, we've got the amazing firepower of a las cannon that's 12 power points shooting into measly cultists as I've screened the sorcerer here so let's see two shots two shots of overkill hitting on three uh, hitting on fours one hit command point to reroll two hits and wounding on twos. Uh, two cultists dead. Oh no. The game is over. I think I have to quit right here. Four shots from the storm bolter into the cultists again. Three hits. Multi Melter hit and winding on uh, threes. Wound. Six up save from the Hellbrood. One. Wah, wah. D6 damage. Three. Bring him down to five wound. So that's the end of Space Wolves. Turn one. Again, nothing really happened. Four cultists died. They're still, uh, still standing. Uh, the Hellbrute took an attack so and like, suffered unstable wounds, so we're going to use Crazed. On a roll of a 6, he gets to make a shooting attack. Oh my gosh, you saw it here. Moldy War Gamer. One shot hitting on 3s. One hit. And wounding on a 3. Save from the bike. Nope. And D6 damage. Command point to reroll that. D6 damage. Five wounds. Five wounds, and that destroys the multi melter. Attacker uh, rolling for reserve, so for the possess coming in on a four, three. Uh, the raptors, three. The marines, woo, they're in. Uh, so we'll see where they get placed and the movement phase for Crimson Slaughter, turn two. So, end of Crimson Slaughter movement phase. The Hell Brutes moved around the building, moving threateningly towards them. And the rages of his pain as he suffered those wounds. He is now a furious, dangerous monster. The cultists have advanced. They're going to mob the Predator tank. The Marines have moved in on, on the field as well, ready for support. Now we move to the psychic phase so he's gonna uh the sorcerer's gonna cast smite onto the tank going off on a five goes off and d3 wounds two wounds and he's just gonna cast warp time on the cultists again so they can 
guarantee that charge. So it goes off on a 10. So the cultist is going to move. All right, so we're on to the shooting phase. Um, he's going to fire his combi bolter, the sorcerer combi bolter, into the tank. Four shots. Hitting on threes. Two hits. Uh, strength four, toughness seven, so winning on fives. Double ones, snake eyes. Wham wham. So 17 rapid fire auto gun shots into the tank, hitting on fours. Eight hits, so winning on sixes. Two wounds, two three up saves. Oh, safe. And another 17 as a rapid fire. Fours. So six hits and winning on sixes. Nothing. He's going to shoot his multi melter. See if he can repeat his same miracle. We pray to the chaos gods. Hitting on a four. Wow, wow. So these guys just uh, moved forward, advanced two inches. He did nothing. These 26 guys did nothing. Even he did nothing. But let's go into uh, the assault as uh, the cultists will now charge into this tank. All right, so um, these guys are going to charge. He's uh, overwatching four shots with the bolter and two with the last cannon, hitting on sixes. Nothing. Wham, wham. And charging seven inches. Easy. All right, so in the fight phase, the cultists have been driven into a frenzy, a righteous frenzy against the evil space wolves. They're going to attack it with their weapons, punch it if they can, bite it, kick it, whatever they can do. So 17 from the auto gun guys, hitting on fours. Get back to you. Attacks, and winning on sixes. Another three wounds. Three more three up saves. Oh, three failed. The Emperor is not looking down upon them. They lose another three more wounds. Seven down to four. So the Predator's making its attacks back. D3 attacks as it's down to its second profile. One attack. One hit. And that's one wound. And six up. One measly cultist dead. Alright, so end of Crimson Slaughter, turn two. Cultists punching, kicking, biting, doing everything they can, ripping straight into that, that tank and locking it in so it can't do anything. It, it can't shoot those weapons anymore. The Grey Hunters here cowering in fear. Will they clear this chaos invasion? Well, we'll find out as we go to Space Wolves turn two. We up to see if the Terminators come in. Oh, they're coming in. Wolf Lord. He's coming in. And Librarian. Not coming in. Last command point to turn the odds. And he's in. So all, all the Space Wolves are now in. We'll come back to that on uh, as we go to the movement phase. See where they went. See where everyone else moves. So end of movement phase for the Space Wolves on turn two. Librarian Wolf Ward have deployed. The Grey Hunters have moved forward looking to engage the enraged Hell Brute. Predator still locked in combat. And looks like his days are numbered and the terminators have moved forward uh, deep struck into the battlefield looking to catch the sorcerer off guard so let's see what happens as we go to shooting phase for space walls on turn two shots from the grey hunters into the furious hell brute hitting on threes So strength four, toughness seven, wounding on five. Two wounds. Three up saves from the mighty hell brute. Woo! So that's the end of Space Wolves turn two. 
on this Imperial planet in ruins under a Chaos Assault. A heavy Chaos Assault. Terminator has managed to take off a single wound to the Lord Drask of the Crimson Slaughter. Now they come under fire as the Marines get to do something. Their fallen brothers will attack with a vengeance. Join me for Crimson Slaughter, turn three. It's coming in on a four. One. Raptors. Woo! So in the movement phase for Crimson Slaughter, the Raptors have deployed. Uh, might have been an incorrect reaction. Alright, so turn three, Crimson Slaughter. Raptors have deployed, aiming for the Wolf Lord, who's done nothing, hoping to take him out. Hell Brute has stomped his way forward. He's furious and looking to kill. The combat with that, we've brought down the Predator to one more wound. So that should be gone at the end of this turn. Another kill point for me. Sorcerers move forward to engage the Terminators, supported by the Traitor Astartes. Join us as we go to the Psychic Phase. Smite. Oh, Sorcerer casting Smite onto the Terminators. Oh, didn't go off. Prescience onto the Chaos Marines. Oh, just goes off on a 7. So they get a plus 1 to hit uh, for all their shooting attacks. Alright, so the... Chaos Space Marine shot into them. Uh, wounded with one bolter shot, but it was the overcharged plasma that ended up taking out two Terminators. Sorcerer's done nothing, they're doing nothing. Hellbrute is going to do some damage. Raptors shooting into the nearest unit, which is the Wolf Lord. We've got the three bolt pistols and one melter. Hitting on threes. Oh, the melter misses. Hitting on equals, uh, so fours. Three wounds. And you get three three up saves. One wound. Down to four. That's the end of the uh, shooting phase for the Crimson Slaughter. Uh, we'll go to the assault here. And charges. Uh, Marines and Sorcerer have charged in successfully into the Terminators. Hellbrute's charging in now. Uh, Overwatch from the Grey Hunters. Bolt guns hitting on sixes. Four wound. Ah, uh, four hits. Raptors are going to join the charging fun because everyone else is doing it. So into um, on a nine. Oh! This tank has been destroyed finally on turn three. See if it's going to blow up on a six. Nope. So combat, Crimson Slaughter. Two more Terminators dead, one, one on one more wound. Tank, crushed, demolished, blown to smithereens, did not explode though, thankfully. Hellbrute took out two Grey Hunters. And the Raptors managed to take a nice chunk out of the Wolf Lord, bring him down to two more wounds as they will return, uh, attack back with the Grey Hunters, Captain, and the Terminators. Alright, so this is going to be deciding. Two Power Sword attacks have got through onto the Sorcerer. Saves on fives. Oh! Did not make it. And he's dead. And he took the sword, the terminator. All right, so I've moved to uh, the combat here. We've got two attacks with the lightning claws onto the wolf lord. Uh, two four up saves required to keep him alive. Oh!
Slay the Warlord. So end of Space Wolves turn, the attack backs from the Crimson Slaughter. Two more Grey Hunters have fallen. Captain's dead. Um, Terminator is still hanging on by a thread. As we move to Crimson Slaughter, turn four as they look to clean this game up. Alright, so Crimson Slaughter turn four. Uh, the possessed have come onto the field. These guys are locked in combat. Locked in combat. Cultists moving forward. The raptors move forward to engage the librarian. We'll come back to you. Um, oh, cultists get to shoot. Oh, and also them. Yeah. Yeah. So Malta gun brought them uh, librarian down to two wounds. Cultists just advanced, uh, and now they're going to charge into this combat here. Command point. My last command point. Seven inches. Easy. Alright, so he's down to one wound, that Terminator. Over to the Raptors for combat. Combats with the Raptors. Threes. All hits. The red dice being the lightning claws, I get to re-roll to wounds. Wounding on fours. Alright, so one three up save. Safe. And two four up saves. One failed. Down to one wound. Actually, we'll see what lightning claws damage is. Wolfguard Terminator is finally dead. Turn 4, Crimson Slaughter. And the Librarian there. So I think at this point we will call it a major victory for the Crimson Slaughter. Um, wow, look at that. Like 20, like, that's, that's like 25 cultists still alive. Hellbrute still alive. That. He would have got chopped up, if not by these guys. Well, these guys would have fallen back. And then Halbert would have done 30 shots and then would have done the trick. The hordes here are gathering. And there we go. So, mission one. The patrol game. On the Imperial planet. The battle for... Hmm, I've got to think of a good name for the campaign. I'll get back to you with that. The Moon, moon Base Classiest campaign was it had a good ring to it, but yeah, I'll think of a cool name, a, a catchy name. This yet to be named campaign for the good of the Imperium will continue. So that that's it. That's it from me, Fano. Another battle report done by me, the Moldy Wargamer. Overwhelming victory for the forces of chaos as an Imperium play player. I am uh, quite conflicted, but you know you got to do what you got to do for the entertainment when you need to swap sides. Um, hope you enjoyed that. Uh, dragged on a bit there after turn three, didn't it? I know it did. I was kind of switching off there, but hey, you know can't all be epic battles like the last campaign. Anyway. Thanks for watching another episode. Make sure you give it a like, a thumbs up, send it to your friends. You know, um, some quality entertainment, low cost, uh, low cost entertainment, gaming on the budget here. As you can see, bloody hand, homemade table, simple, easy. Join me for mission two, as the space wolves uh, hope to clear the infestation. Thanks for watching. Kakite Anor.